Hey folks, welcome back to Stranded Alien Dawn, where we have another malfunction ceiling lamp. I am not used to them going so fast. But Carter is up to take out one last section of fence before we replace it as well. Um, copy, and that should be pretty much enough of the tall fence around here to hopefully force these monsters to make the turn. We can get them to here. We can maybe get them in the gauntlet. But it has been frustrating, all these battles on the side. Of course, there is also, you know, the whole issue over here. If the bugs come around this side, they want to kill all of our animals along the way. There is that. It's those shriekers. They're the ones. Oh, the other ones can reach over and do something a little bit, but... Yeah, the shriekers are the worst ones. Especially when they went after our prince. I never even thought about how vulnerable this area was where he used to spend most of his time. Anyway, get that one going. Rita is still or just waking up. She's going to grab something to eat and she's going to start cooking, I hope. be nice to get some real meals in there. we got one loaf of bread and two meat pies right now. Carter's going to go scavenge these because I got to thinking... We might not get another uh, ship to come in if this is still sitting here. And it takes him a long time to do it the hard way. It, it, it's, it's right there, Carter. Right there. So Rita is eating. The loaf of bread actually is right there. Rita, how you doing? Your happiness is not very good. Why don't you go eat a loaf of bread instead? I think that'd be better. We'll, we'll save the uh, dried meat for when... Uh, Actually, I didn't see you put it down. Did that magically teleport back, or is it in your pocket? I don't know. <laughs> anyway, Simon, you are... Oh, you're transporting grains. Your fullness is fine for a while, and I asked you to get these furnaces up and running. We've scavenged... Oh, we brought in the six that we... Double-clicking is doing no good, because you're... You were not carrying it. What you doing? You're repairing a ceiling lamp. Yeah, I think that's going to be the uh, um, the the hallmark of the end of the series. Ah, it was Carter's own ceiling lamp. Um, what'd you do? Oh, you want to go drop off alloy. Okay, now you're going to go back and finish it. Okay, so he's got to replace... I'd say it's like replacing a light bulb, but it takes an awful lot of of uh, alloy to, to do the job. Anyway, you're going to construct a tower that's been waiting all this time. That's this guy. And then you'll get to filling these in, which I really think ought to be done first. So, Carter, what does it mean to do this? Construct that? I'm curious. Does it mean to trip up the mountain? We have 30 sitting here, so you can do three of them. We have, oh, we got something, we have 100 right there. Okay, well, that's helpful. There's 10 more. And nothing over there. Are you going to grab the 100? Whoa. Okay. Now we're, now we're cooking with gas. Well, most of it. <laughs> Left 12. Hopefully it's enough to, to run this whole circuit here. In that case, it is noon. Simon, I've already assigned you to do a bunch of these things, but there would be time to get up there and get another load. I think I'll do that. As soon as you've dropped off that one, what are you doing here? You're going to pick up... That looks like bricks. What are you... I, I have no idea what that was. But I think it would be a good idea to get you a... Meat pie. It says we have some. Are they in here? Uh, I can never see. There you are. It's hard to see the bottom of these things. So not there. Click away, grab Simon, and try that one. There we go. Eat meat pie. Then, let's send you up for another run. There's 50 there. There's 36 there. There's 100. I'm going to send you for the 40. 
and we'll just see what you do with that. Maybe you'll grab all these spares on your way to getting it. Who knows? They're, they they kind of pick things up in strange orders at times, so I can't even predict it. So, Carter, how you doing? I don't know. They're not turning purple. I guess you're going to the very end and working backward. So I'm guessing by their weird pathing that they cannot go past this guy. So putting that gate there did us no good. We still gotta walk all the way well we can Yeah. All the way around to come in here. Okay, so gates might need to be rethought. But to put it here, across from that one, which would make the most sense, is a straight shot to take something out. So that's no good. Now hmm. I was gonna say I can drop it somewhere else, but really just need to move the power pole. What does that mean? It means putting the power pole over here instead. Huh. Yeah, they're doing a lot of running in circles because they can't walk past this. Huh. If could you move to and will it still work? Uh right here. That does work and it still connects everything. And that opens up the pathway again. To be able to get in and repair that guy. Because this would block from this direction. Yeah. Okay. So Carter, you are petting an orphan. Okay. I guess I need to turn that feature off. That can be done, right? Because they get less... They spend more time getting less benefit out of it. Uh, Carter. Here. No. Animals? Tamed animals? Petting. Let's turn these guys off and let them go back to, to admiring shroom torches. Alright, Carter. You are going to get something to eat. Um... I take it there's the bread was never done. I assigned Rita to do two different things in the stoves. Okay, we'll try it again. Make bread and make meat pie. All right, you work on those for a while. Rita is in decent condition. She really could use a, a break soon too. Okay, Carter, you as well wanted a break, so you can do the other instrument. And a torch. Simon is bringing back 130. Nice. Now 50 is still sitting there. 36 is still there. So he went for the 40 and kind of left some stragglers around. Okay. Well, if we can be there his next trip and guide him from one pile to the other, then maybe we can clean up all the rest of that and be done. Unless we decide we're going to raise any of these other walls. That I don't know. Huh. Well, I mean, for that matter, if they're going to attack valuable assets, this would be a candidate right there. Hmm. Yeah, I have to think about raising the walls over there. All right, so Carter, Rita... Simon, coming in. Carter Reach Intellect 4? How is that? Maybe you get intellect from uh, playing music. I never thought about that. Hmm. So, Carter, you're back to being in pretty good condition. Let's get this moved, and then let's get to work on these and get this finished. Right there. Bunch of wind coming in. Turn you off, turn you off. Now look at that sky. It's all the little noises. Oh, birds. I think it's little feet. I can't tell. Unpowered device motion sensor. That's fine. Move that over. Reconnect everything. Good. 
now we have a pathway. Rita Reach Cooking 7. Look at that. Walking through there like a boss. <laughs> That's what was supposed to happen all those other times. It's kind of silly making this pathway to get around to go and do that. Or how did he do it? I think he went through here and through and around. Yeah. All right, getting dark already. 8 p.m. So Simon has not made it back yet. So when he's done, we'll see what he decides to do on his own. We're up to 52 alloy now, but that's just a couple of these guys down, and and uh, we'll be hurting again. So we need to get ahead of that. Um, well, we don't know how much ore we actually have, because that counts everything on the map, not everything that's in your base. So that doesn't help. Carter is sitting. Makes me want to put a a gate right there. It really does. Yeah. Um, yeah. Let's do that. Which kind, though? Defense. Door. We have these guys for 100. <clears throat> these guys for 500. These walls are at 100. So the wooden ones will just be the equivalent to what was already there. Okay. So if I were to... Oh, let's... Yeah, let's just do that. So what do I want here? Defense and door. Let's go with these. We're going to downgrade here if we do that, but I guess that'll have to do. Let's put one there and one there. And that gets them walking through here a little bit easier. Malfunctioned wind turbine needs 12. Yeah, I guess that's the event of choice for the end game. One bird wants to... One? Oh, four. Okay, they all got here. and They're going to take everything out on that, on that glutch. Now these two know what they're what they're there for. So they're gonna go do this. Carter, everything here is fine, right? Simon is visiting Adraka. That's interesting. That wasn't a choice. Tamed, pet. Huh. So he can visit. <laughs> what are these symbols? Lead. Copy. Copy? I'll copy the the uh, choices here. You can't choose whether or not to pet these guys, apparently. So he's visiting. So what does that do for him? Let's see if visit comes up. He's transporting. So watched an animal is the same thing. So they're going to do it for plus 10, whether I want them to or not. Okay, where are the birds? Two are running in right now. Oh, they're running back. Falling spaceship debris. Just sent them back. This is coming in way over here. So we can watch them and it at the same time. They want to join them again. So they can all go in as a unit. Okay, you're over there. It's a big one too. Yeah, we'll set it. Probably won't do anything with it, but... Looks good. Still glowing red over there from the... From uh, being on fire. Yeah. Ah, that's right. These missiles are something else. Okay, got trapped. Missed, too dark. Too dark to see it. Aha. So, this guy would definitely be advantageous over here. We could maybe pop it right in here. We took this guy out. Let's play with that idea. Let's deconstruct that one. This guy's getting hit. He's he's closer to the light. And down he goes. Is that all of them? That was all of them. Oh, that noise. Yeah. So Carter is constructing a... He's still working on that tower. I think I'm going to let him do it this time. He's going to get a little frustrated if I keep telling him no. Okay, so you're needing 20 more wood. Let's see if that was just enough to finish the job. Simon's going to sleep. Rita's going to sleep. Hmm. 
Okay, Simon, what is left up here for tomorrow? Am I close enough? There we go. 50. 18. So, 68. Uh, 98, 104. And that is it. 104. Okay. I wonder if I could send Simon up to mine just one of them. I wonder if he could do it. Mining is physical. He could do it. It would just take him a while. And he can bring that and all the rest of them back. And that would be over. Or if I just have him bring what's there and that's it. No, no, what? Are you saying we have no logs whatsoever? We have no logs. Okay, Carter, go to bed. Hmm. Three in the morning. So, let's take some trees down. Any in particular that would be helpful? Actually, yeah. Let's take you and you and you. Missiles will be dropping in those areas anyway, including here. So we'll have Carter do some cutting in the morning. And I'd say you guys are a little bit of a defense issue as well. Okay, we'll leave it at that. Alright, Simon's up. Transporting. Oh, that... One mill that went down. That must still be down. Okay. Rita is waking up. She's got some cooking to do. And Carter, let's get well, let's get some food in you. Got bread anywhere? Yeah. You need a little more sleep, so I'll let you sleep a little further. Then you'll get bread. Then I want you to take down. I think it's probably safe to well, at least this one deconstruct that but I think go ahead and construct waiting for other construction so deconstruct it's already in queue I see all right you've already got that figured out okay but then you could do this one I don't know if that's in queue deconstruct brick fence I guess, yeah, that is the other one. Okay. Now, do we have a lightning rod? Is that what you are? Yeah, so we're protected over here. So we've got thunder rolling through. Was there not a lightning rod right in here? Uh, there you are. That is that area. That protects all of this. Okay. So Carter can work in this area safely. For the most part. Except we do need some traps to reset too. Alright. So back to speed two. Let's get a little further into this. Transporting. Okay. So Simon is doing that. Do we... Let's wait to see if this is a thunderstorm. It's not. Okay. Then Simon. Let you do your transporting. And then let's... Get you back up here. You're gonna hate it being in the rain, but uh, your fullness is no good. Let's find a meat pie somewhere. Uh, right there. Simon, why don't you eat a meat pie right now? Then I want you. I want you to go tap on one of these. Mind that. Oops. I hit the wrong thing. Can you? Finish your meat pie? Yeah, how do you do that? I don't know, let's draft undraft. Will he... Nope, he won't. Okay, so I guess the food you got is the food you're going to have. Alright, come on up here. We'll make this work. So, do this first. And I'm going to have to just be up here to watch you. I just want you to do one of them. And if that's taking forever, then I'll even skip that. Okay, Rita is harvesting some more. Let's harvest this area. Um, 
what are these called? The the two roots. How many of those do we already have? A thousand. Okay. You are set to not harvest. Rita, come on over here and do these. Yeah, thank you. And when you're done, Nile, you'll automatically haul them in. Carter's over here. Taking this one out. Stop. Okay. So I want another light up here, maybe. Let's copy. You do work. And that lights up the area right there so that the turrets can hit them just as soon as they turn the corner. Or is that what we want? That might be more advantageous. This one just lights up there, so this whole corner is missing. If we do that, it misses the corner still. I think that's more of what we want. This wall is blocking the view of anything over here anyway. Okay, that goes there. And... What's it going to take to get Carter to actually construct these? More wood. Yeah. Then you're going to cut these guys. We need some logs. And then you're going to build that one first. Probably should have changed the order a little bit here. Simon is not there yet. Okay. Thirty? These take what? These take ten. Carter, let's get these guys built now. With those thirty. What you doing? Uh, dude. <laughs> Try this again. Let's do that. Carter! All wood! What? <laughs> I don't understand. <sighs> Repairing a wind turbine? No! Carter! All wood! Man, it's like pulling teeth! Okay, so you're going to do that, and then you're going to start building. You are not, so we're going to construct. Oh, you did two in a row. Okay. Then, in that case, let's have you take this one down as well. And that's good enough. Then, well, then I'll have you haul wood one more time to over there, the uh, the tower, and you will not have to make this trip again as soon as you appreciated your shroom torch. Okay, transporting those, and well, you only needed 12 more. Okay, that's fine. You go do that, and this job will finally be done. Okay, Simon, you made it, and that's enough. Wow, it's a hundred per. I didn't realize that. Come on down. Go ahead and haul these and tell me you can find 30 more. You can't. So can I coax you over to hauling these next? Or as well. Perfect. Okay, so we still have some up here we're going to have to come up and get. Otherwise they're randomly going to make the trip on their own when I'm not expecting them to. All right, are we sealed up here, Neil? We're sealed up around the perimeter. We're more convenient to get through here for pathing. Simon is... Now he's going to find another way in. Okay. Carter's going to get this guy repaired. And what is a Carter job now? Constructing a tower. Okay. Then when you're done, Carter... Why don't you help Rita out by carrying in the grain? Rita is doing bush beer. What are these things called? 
beef berries, which we have 600. More than we need. Let's divert Rita to finishing off these. Uh, harvest. And then she'll carry some in as well. Okay. So that's good. Tower's done. Transporting. Animals are fine. Animals have no food. Because uh, we've turned Rita off of tending because that's all she wanted to do. Okay, let's get that dealt with immediately. So, I want activities. Rita, you are back to... Well, you're ranching as a one. So, what happened there? Carter, we'll turn you back to a one as well. We have hay. And it's sitting there. And you're still set to hay, right? Yeah. Okay. Maybe we're just not keeping up with five animals. That could be it. So let's take you, copy, and drop one in right there. And Carter, when you're done, you'll be, you'll survive. You can go and construct that. Rita, when you're done, you can haul in a load, and then you can go and fill them up. And you'll be fine, too. So you're transporting those, then you are going to bring food. Perfect. Simon, still on your way in. And you're going to drop off here. Great. And we got a spaceship detected. Alright, so we'll see what this one means. So Simon, you get the honor of contacting the spaceship. After you find place for all of those to go. Oh, they fit. Good. Alright, so let's see what's up there. Rita is going to go feed the Ulfin and Dracas. Carter's going to build, well, yeah, Carter's going to build the Draca feeder. We've got a rescue offer coming in. Passing by ship offers sent a rescue, but only has space for one passenger. Yes. Alright, coming in. So, at that point, I believe Simon would be next. Yep, I think so. I mean, there's so many things he could do, but I think we are ahead enough now to pull that off. Um, malfunction orbital antenna. We got that in just in time. So, insufficient materials by 15. Wow. Okay. Well, Simon went to bed. Simon gets up in the morning. He's fullness will be fine, his rest will be fine, his relaxation will be down a little bit. Let's have him appreciate a shroom torch, and then let's have him... Oh! When I saw smelt metal, I, I, my mind said sheet metal. Like, scrap metal. We're making it only out of scrap metal now. Okay, okay, a little brain fart there. This one says refuel, so we can't even... Yeah, apparently we have to refuel before we can do any of it. Okay, fine. We'll do that. We'll, we'll catch it next round. Let's just load him up with things to do. He'll have enough food to pull it off. Um, Rita, you tomorrow. Actually, what are you going to do on your own right here? Are you going to get something to eat? Yeah, you're going to get something to eat. Then you're going to sleep. Then you are going to make buttermelon pie. And you're going to make meat pie. Carter, getting something to eat, going to bed, and I, well, this one, okay, we'll construct that, but beyond that, actually, pause, where are you doing right now? Carter, constructed lamp, now let's draft, undraft, go to bed, then you're going to do a shroom torch, you're going to do a double one, because your relaxation is zero. Then you're going to get out here and get this done. Kind of... Oh, and then you're going to get these guys set. I kind of forgot about that. Yeah, four more. And then whatever's left over here, three more. Okay. So with all of that, where am I at now? I'm only half hour in. I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm getting ready to close the episode. But yeah, we can go a little longer. 
Well, it felt like I've already been here an hour. <laughs> okay, so orbital antenna is down, and that needs 45 alloy. Wow. Okay. Yeah, we're going to really be needing the alloy if if Rita is ever going to go home. <laughs> we need both antennas functioning. All right, so what's happening out here? These guys are still standing up sleeping. These guys are eating like crazy. Uh, cannot be trained, but no other messages like they're starving. Hmm. You're done. You're done. You probably won't let me get rid of that one or that one. Yeah. Okay, we're all eating over here. We're going to wipe that out real quick. So, Rita, when you're done with whatever your other lists were, let's have you fill this one up. One round of that. So, Carter... Simon, that's who I saw. You're going to quickly fill up furnaces and all that great stuff. Handling furnaces. We still have ore hiding in here. Nice. That's good to see. So we have enough at least for one more full round of this. Boy, I really could send Simon on another trip, but... Now that we know how to make them eat on foot without having to go to a table, I could send Carter up there, have him stop at a berry bush, eat a, a meal, and then continue. So it's possible that we could have him go and get more ore if he needs to. Though I think it'd be easier to send him out to some place out over here that's... Yeah, there's still a few more places that... I'm sure there's, there's more ore that's dropped, or more of a recent meteor shower that I never bothered to mark. Seems like there would be. Or we just use scrap metal. Yeah, I almost forgot about that. We can scrap metal this and not have to worry about it. Okay. Handling furnace, Rita's cooking. Carter is building. No more attacks yet. Uh, 13 hours. It's going to go by real quick, running at speed 2, so i got to remember not to miss Simon's trip home. That's going to be easy to do. So Simon is just going to load these guys up. And... Rot it away, malfunction wind turbine. Ah, uh, it is going to eat our alloy up fast. Insufficient storage space for bricks. That was a weird no. Unfinished bricks. Okay, you just yeah, just drop it on the ground. That's I'm not worried about that. <laughs> Alright, so Simon is handling furnace. Eleven hours left. So that is basically almost midnight. So as we wrap up this day, that's when Simon will go home. That'll be fine. Simon eating good buttermelon pie, probably his last one here. Repairing the orbital antenna. Uh, this guy, sh this stuff should be almost ready. You're transporting. Got to keep filling up those shroom torches. All right, you're going to stop there. And you're going to do these guys. Now that we have loaded up all of the, uh, the sticks in them. Sticks, hay is gone. Okay. So, Carter, you are repairing orbital antenna. You need... wood. Okay, instead, let's just have you haul all the wood in, if that's possible. They tend not to do that. They tend just to bring what they need for a repair project, which is frustrating. Rimworld, you just tell them to haul it all in. And then they would take it to the stockpile, then go back out and bring just the few that they need. But Simon is transporting the remainder, well, some to there. Okay, uh, eight hours left. These are all running. You'll probably have just enough time to get these last three furnaces up and going. And we'll start calling for Rita's ride. Seven hours left. Carter brought back five. 
That big long trip, he brought back five. Okay. Carter, you are now on a cutting mission. You're going to cut giant grass. And you're going to cut more giant grass for hay. And then you're going to cut trees as soon as Simon leaves. Which is in six hours. <laughs> We're not going to travel the map to get five more logs. No more. Leaving in six hours looking for a Rita. There you are. Transporting berries. Okay. Five hours. Getting this cutting done. And... I know what he's going to do, so may as well just get it done. Well, now, we'll go ahead and finish that. He's just going to bring back enough to fill up one food tray. Five hours left. Transporting the 20. This is ready to go. Still not ready to go. Okay. So, we're loaded. Simon, just leave that there and get one last run done. Four hours left. Carter's almost finished. Rita's taking a walk. Which is only good for a plus six. Oh, plus nine. And your favorite pastime. Really? Rita? And taking walks. Well, there you go. Didn't realize that. Three hours left for Simon. I think we're going to call this done. Or something happens and we forgot. Simon's transporting that back. Or aggressive animals. Big ones too. Are they still zoning in? They're down here. Okay. Well, Rita and Carter are going to find out what it's like to take this on alone. So Carter, as soon as you bring that in and drop it off, Two hours left. I will... Yep. Oh, you did come up here to drop it off. Okay. So with that, Carter, draft. Come on over here. Rita, you are drinking tea. There. Draft. Come on over here. And this time, for the... Well, the second time, I'm going to remember to tell the person who's leaving to leave their stuff in the house not out there in the ground <laughs> you are a nun and you are a nun and you'll do that now yeah you do that and you want to transport now you can leave it there let's get you gone well I guess there is kind of time kind of at least for one of them yeah good enough board Simon and take us back down to one speed. Okay. It was hard, but I survived. Goodbye. And what was that noise? That was a bone crusher. And he's out of here, melting the circuit boards as it takes off. Carter, you should probably move those. Yeah. Okay. Carter... Undraft, Hall, Rita, Undraft, and what I don't know. How are these doing on your way in? 20, fuel 20, 20, 20, 20. Let's have you do that on your way in. You might hit all four. All right, so these guys are coming in. Oh, three or four in the morning. So, Carter's sleep. Carter's in horrible shape. Okay, so Carter, you're going to have to get everything up and running except for sleep. I don't think there's going to be time for anything else. So, let's get you some bread, which doesn't exist. Eat meat pie. There it is. Eat buttermelon pie. We'll go that route. Okay, do that, and then you're going to play music and appreciate a shroom torch and take a seat. 
and we'll get two of your bars maxed out which should do you some pretty good Rita is filling these up and then she really could use a meat pie and if there's still time you can do the other music as well so you guys will be as ready as you can be when this attack comes in and I think I've still got time to incorporate this attack into this episode so we'll do that then we'll call this done Wow what a mess all right so we have got one Juno 13 regular shriekers and 70 scarabai scarabai don't bug me although they are eating our our wild buttermelons but they don't bug me unless something tears that fence piece apart and then they all start flooding in through here yeah that's the uh, the uh, the bug cam <laughs> You see those videos where they strap a, a camera on a cat and then turn him loose and he goes about his day roaming the property and chasing birds and visiting other cats and things like that. Yeah, that was the bug cam. All right, so Carter is... Rita went to sleep. That's... Okay. I guess you did your things. Oh, we're still running at, at that speed. Okay, that's why. Yeah, Carter's going to try and get a little bit of sleep in. Uh, new insect nest and the animals are attacking. Insect nest is over here. Still quite a ways away. Not a threat and not really an advantage. Now, last time it took these guys a long time to come in. So I might just let them sleep an extra hour. I think so. They're attacking. This guy doesn't know where he's attacking. Oh, what? That way? Oh, okay. Yeah, uh-huh. Wait, what? <laughs> um. Okay. Well, he, he's not too uh, excited about things. Yeah. So we'll let these guys maybe even get a full night's sleep in. We'll see. We'll watch it from here. We definitely have two camps. You guys are trying to go off that direction, aren't you? That's scary. There's a lot of them there. I need you guys to go this way. I really do. Because the Olfen and Draka are over there, and these tails are going to hit them. We might uh, have another uh, mournful episode, if that's the case. They are clearly going a different, different route. Wow. Okay, damage lightning rod. Where's that at? Oh, you guys are hitting over here. Okay, all right. It's time to get you guys in. So Rita, come on out here and perch over here. And we're gonna go with no stun gun this time. Um, uh, Carter, you're gonna pass it on your way. And no, Simon put it away. Carter. Pulse Rifle. Equip it. I think there is an advantage to stunning several of them and making them stop. Rather than picking off one at a time. I think so. Okay, so you did that? You did. Now, draft and come on out to here with Rita. Okay. What do we got? You guys are clearly going that way. Darn. You guys have taken the long way around this way. Follow the leader. Okay. And these guys are now kind of changing their minds. They're, where are we shooting? How are we shooting? We're not shooting. Oh, missile launches? Missile launches. Okay. Rita, where are you? You two are still running, so those were not, not bullets. Okay. Good. Coming in. Boom. Alright. Those look good. Now, what's the, what's the decision down here? We're just kind of hovering and getting angry at things. 
but for the most part, we're all heading this way. Good, good, good. We have one lone one who doesn't know what he wants to do. Damaged wooden stairs. You guys are just kind of beating things up over here. <laughs> Devices. You're taking out a power pole, which I think only supplies uh, these guys. So there's nothing critical. Okay, and the other device is up there, and you're still picking at it, you turkey. All right, we're coming around the corner. We are, but these guys are so low. I bet you they can't hit them. Oh, they're sure trying. Okay, oh, that was really close on the fence line. Yep, we hurt ourselves a little bit there. That missile's got to move. You recenter to a little further out. Not going to do a lot of good, but let's just check all these guys. You, target. Yeah, i got to keep you away from the, from the fence. I don't know where you were, but let's put you... That looks pretty good right there. And that last one, we're good? Where am I? Right there. Now let's go a little further out. That's as far out as I can get. Okay. Okay, that's working. Down here, any surprises? You're just picking at that one gate. Yep. Nothing went around? Nothing went around. Okay. Destroyed lightning rod. He just picked at it and picked at it and picked at it. Yeah, he, he feels like he accomplished something. All right, this guy is ignoring traps, isn't he? Oh, he finally got... No. He's stunned. Interesting. And killed him. Traps didn't do anything for him. All right, these guys are still making the way around. This is looking pretty good. This, this big wall over here was a good improvement. All right, another missile coming in. Yep. Nope, not the one I was thinking of. I see. These guys are sneaking past. So if this wall were further out, they would go further into missile territory. Yeah. Okay, that's an improvement. And for that matter, same thing here. I think they would naturally track a little further away and we could hit out here with the missiles. Okay, we'll play with that. And just to verify it, though to me it seems like this would just add a new target for them to stop and pick at, but if they do, that's not a big deal. Okay, bombs are dropping like crazy. Right, anything else out here? No, just two scarabi being really annoying. Destroyed wooden stairs. Otherwise, picking the big guys off. Boom. And probably part of our walls. <laughs> Which is why Carter has got to be the last one here. He's got to be able to go back and repair some of these things in between uh, episodes. So you, Carter, if I said... If I said... Go here. And Rita... I said, hmm, I don't know if you can hit him. He's right underneath you. You do have the range, though, to hit him from here. Okay. All the rest of them walking around, missiles and whatnot, will take care of those. Yeah, you can take care of him. And, yeah, Carter can work on that one. Still a few creepy crawlies here and there. Oh, he stopped to hit Carter. Carter, take a hit. Uh, I'm looking through the list. I don't see injuries. Oh, that's a Rita. That's a Rita. Um, right there, you're fine. So this did deflect it. Good. Boom. And who's going to take this one out? Rita, you got him? Of course you do. Carter, you got him? You do. Okay. We're done. Wow. What a mess. Carter, both of you guys, undraft. And... Stats-wise, a little more rest. 
would do you some good. It's 8 in the morning. Carter, why don't you go back to sleep for a little bit? You're down quite low for being so early in the morning. Rita, you're fine. You're going home next. Let's... Everything else here can be can just sit for a, a half a day. Why don't you immediately come in and get one more round of somethings? I'm not seeing breads. Not enough resources. Oh, we need these guys going. I need vegetable oil. Vegetable oil, vegetable oil, and then meat pie, and then butter melon pie. So we get a few meals ahead. For Carter, so we can have some some happy meals, <laughs> some McDonald's happy meals to uh, bide him over while he's he's all alone at the very end. But with that, we've got a bunch of stuff to clean up here next time. Let's security signal. <laughs> I'll leave that there. So let's call this this mess done. Catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye bye.